I made this video for other um, Flatline P38 owners. Uh, in this particular flight, this was the second flight um, after the maiden on the same day. Um, on the first uh, flight, the maiden flight, uh, pretty much just flew the pattern. Um, nothing special. Um, just wanted to get the uh, throws and everything sorted out. Uh, and then make sure that you know I felt comfortable landing it, which um, that that was pretty uneventful. It's pretty easy to land the P-38. So on the second flight, um, tried to um, do a little more with it. Um, you know, did a did a roll. Uh, you know, with with the P-38, it turns out to be more of a barrel roll than a roll. Um, and then here in a little bit, uh, I tried to basically just go vertical uh, and see how high it would climb. Right. Um, that went okay until I got to the top, and when uh, it started uh, started to slow down, I cut the throttle, and like I typically do, I'll just uh, uh, you know loop it back over itself, and then come back down, and then roll on a little elevator, uh, and uh, then come out of that uh, that dive. Um, but here, in a second, here you'll see that here we're going up vertical. Uh, we get to the top, try to loop it over, but it fails. And then it falls back down, and then here I'm pulling the elevator, and nothing happens, right? Obviously not not a great second flight. So um, upon inspection, we'll see this in just a second. Um, the elevator uh, horn had come out of the uh, the elevator, okay? Um, and you know, I looked at it a little closer. You can see some of these pictures that um, there there's not a lot of glue. Um, that's basically holding this horn in, right? So that's all there is. It's just a horn stuck into the elevator, um, and then there's glue applied to it. So here you can see that there's glue at the surface of the horn and where there's like a cross, but in the center where the holes are, there's no glue. So, um, you know, this might be something that other owners might be careful of and just take note of, 